Have you ever heard of the Saqqara bird? Found in a tomb in Egypt back in 1898, this small wooden artifact looks suspiciously like a modern airplane. It's got wings, a fuselage, and a tail. This has led to some wild theories. Could ancient Egyptians have actually understood the principles of flight thousands of years before the Wright brothers? Yeah, let's take a closer look. The Saqqara bird is made of sycamore wood. It's about six inches long with a wingspan of seven inches. The most intriguing part is its design. Unlike other bird carvings from that era, this one has wings that are shaped like an airfoil, which is crucial for generating lift. Its tail is also vertical, like a rudder on a plane, not horizontal like a bird's tail feathers. This has fueled the idea that it wasn't just a toy, but a model of a real working glider. Proponents of this theory even built replicas. Some of these larger scale models actually flew, suggesting the design is aerodynamically sound. Imagine that. Glider soaring over the Nile, centuries before we thought it was possible. Did they build full-sized versions? Were they just experimenting with the concept of flight? It's a fascinating thought. Of course, there are more conventional explanations. Mainstream Egyptologists believe it's likely a ceremonial object, a high-end children's toy, or even a fancy wather vane that would have been mounted on the masts of sacred boats. They point out that it's missing a horizontal stabilizer, key component for stable flight, which would have made it incredibly difficult to control. Also, there are no other supporting artifacts, no hangars, no runways, no ancient pilot manuals. So was it a simple toy or a clue to lost ancient technology? While the evidence for ancient flight is thin, the Saqqara bird remains one of Egypt's most puzzling mysteries. It challenges our assumptions about the past and reminds us that ancient civilizations were far more sophisticated than we often give them credit for. What do you think? Is it an ancient glider or just an elaborate toy? Let me know your theory in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more journeys into the unknown.